Hi everybody and welcome to Treasure Time for this week. Reverend Vicky here. It's lovely to be with you and we're going to continue looking at the amazing people in God's story and this week we're thinking about you and me <laughs> and others. Amazing people in God's story and how we can be those amazing people. But before we move on to our Bible story, we're going to have a brilliant song video now, which is a bit of a mashup of lots of worship songs. So I hope that you spot one that you like. And this is sure to make sure that you're awake and uh, you've got a big smile on your face as we worship God together. the book for me. I stand alone on the word of God, the B-I-B-L-E, the B-I-B-L-E. Yes, that's the book for me. I stand alone on the word of God, the B-I-B-L-E. I've been waiting all week long for Sunday to come so I can sing my song, have a little church and do our thing. Everybody's rocking to the Sunday school swing. Yeah, yeah, sun's gonna swing, all right. The charge of the bad love, Jericho, Jericho, Jericho. The charge of the bad love, Jericho, and the walls came tumbling down. The charge of the bad love, Jericho, Jericho, Jericho. The charge of the bad love, Jericho, and the walls came tumbling, tumbling down. I've been waiting all week on for Sunday to come so I can sing my song, have a little church and do our thing. Everybody's rocking to the Sunday school swing. Ooh, the Sunday school swing. He's got the his hands has got the whole world in his hands has got the whole world in his hands has got the whole world in his hands he's got the whole world in his hands has got the whole world in his hands has got the whole world in his hands has got the whole world in his hands Yes, I know. Hey, nice to see you. Thought I would say hello in person and bring you our Bible story of this week. I wonder if you've ever visited a maze or whether you've done one of those puzzle mazes maybe with um, a, a pencil of trying to find your way through the maze and you might go up a few kind of dead ends and then have to go back or you get to a point and you go I don't know which way to go to go through the maze and uh, the story today 
the, the picture of the story uh, reminded me of a maze today and I'm going to show you the uh, picture. So here we are. And it's from a book called Children of God by Archbishop Desmond Tutu. And this story is called God Gives Us the Greatest Commandment, the Law of Love. Sometimes it seems like there are so many rules. It's often hard to know which ones are most important. In Jesus' time, people argued about which rule was most important to God. One of the elders, that's a very wise leader, bent over with age and wisdom. And he heard Jesus teaching his followers. The elder thought to himself, wow, this guy really knows what he's talking about. The elder leaned on his cane, like his walking stick, and scratched his white hair. You seem very wise, he said to Jesus. Tell me, what is the most important rule of all? There are two, Jesus replied. The first is to love God with all your heart, with all your soul and with all your mind and with all your strength. The second is to love everyone as much as you love yourself. The elder nodded. You are right, he said. The greatest gift we can offer God is to love him and love his children. And here's the picture of Jesus with a big love heart or, and uh, sunshine, isn't it? It looks like a sunrise around him. And can you see all of the little children playing around him and wanting to be with him? And actually that's part, our part in God's story, to love God, but also to show his love to one another. And we could ask that question of, well, what does that look like? So I've got a little video for you to watch about being kind and showing love to one another. I hope you enjoy it.
I like that little video because it shows us different ways how we can be kind to one another. How we can show our love and care for each other. And whether that's because we've dropped our ice cream and so someone gives us a new one or whether that's when we fall over on the playground and someone takes us to the teacher so that they can look after us and care for us and, and treat maybe our little greys on our knee or whatever it is. So we're going to have a moment now just to think about how we can be kind to someone else today and over the next few days. We may also want to say sorry to God for the times that we haven't been kind. So let's just have a little bit of quiet to think about what it means to be kind. Well, we've come to the end of another treasure time. Well, nearly. We're going to finish off with a great video song, which is all about our amazing and wonderful God. So remember, as you go through this week, this same amazing and wonderful and strong and big God that we sing about is also the God that loves you and asks you to love each other as well. So please think this week about how you can show God's love to someone else in the kind things that you do. I hope you enjoy the song. Bye for now. <laughs>